Hello musical friends and family, we're going to do a third video today of the Polina Mosca census playlist. Reason being is because I finished the G minor chord page where I was stuck on. See, this is the part where I was stuck on. As you can see, I scribbled and crossed out a few chords because they weren't... I messed up. So, this is how I understand piano playing. <laughs> I'm weird. When I see a piano sheet with lines and dots, I I don't understand it. This is how I understand. There are certain ones in parentheses right here, right? This is a B, D, F, A. So that just means there is a chord in there or I cannot find it in a book. Sometimes I make up chords in order to find the sound of the song. You don't always have to use a made up chord. If you can find a chord that you're comfortable using with, be my guess, but this is what I have so far. If this is a chord, B, D, F, A flat, let me know. Other thing, sometimes when I do parentheses, I do a, a chord plus a single key. So that just literally means the C minor chord is on the right side while the G, just the single key of G is on the left. And I press that together and I form that into a chord. I don't think that's a chord on piano. I didn't find it in a chord book. If it is a chord, please let me know. Another thing, the last thing I want to mention, I use two diminishes in my chords. So I use E diminish and D diminish. So two different ones. When chordify their version, they use B diminish, which I'm not too sure where that is parts played of, but I know probably it, there's a meaning. There's a meaning for it. But in my version, I use E diminish and D diminish, or two diminishes. So without further ado, let's practice this one. I finished it. Let's see.
Something like that. Yeah. That's so far, that's it. We'll do the tutorial, practice that one, practice the lyrics, do both versions, and we'll be good to go.